welcome to the Administrator Advanced Features Training Menu. Please note that if you are a single administrator and trainer on your system, the Manage Staff and Clients and Advanced Features will not be displayed in the Admin Menu. They'll be available in the Trainer Menu to reduce redundancy in the system. If at any point you add additional administrators or trainers to your system, these options will then become available. In this video, we'll be looking at some of the advanced features. We'll begin with competitions. You can create a competition amongst clients, trainers, and administrators in your system quickly and easily, and the system will track the results over time and give rankings and comparisons. In this case, we have an existing competition that has been built. If you want to add a new one, simply click the Add New button, or you can edit existing competitions or delete them. Clicking the Edit button will activate the fields of this current competition. You can use the drop-down to select between any other competitions you have added at any given time. You can now give the competition a name, Choose whether or not to, you want to hide client names for privacy. This means if it is unchecked, all client names will be listed in the rankings, so all clients can see their name and every other person involved in the competition. If you select the Hide Client Names for Privacy feature, the client will only see their own name with the rest of the spaces being labeled as private. You can choose a start and end date for your competition, and these are the date ranges that the system will use to track results. Then, you can choose users to compare in the competition. You can either manually choose them by selecting one by one, or using the shift or control buttons to select multiple, or you can use the buttons on the left to select all users, only clients, only trainers, or only administrators. Once you've selected your users, you can select what criteria you want to monitor in the competition. In this case, we've chosen to monitor the weight, total change, and waist, navel, and hips measurements, total change. In this case, these three measurements will be added together for one score. If you wanted to monitor each individual measurement, scrolling further down, you could select each one individually. We've also selected to monitor competition points. In this case, in the Master Preferences area, we've created a series of questions and assigned point values. The clients on their member homepage will be prompted to check off each day whether they have completed that specific task and will be assigned a series of points based on your input. The system will then track those points over the course of the competition. You can click the Review View Results button at the bottom of the page, and the system will then compile a list of the current standings in the competition. If the date, current date is between the start and end date of the competition, this chart will be, be available for every client in their progress tracking area as well. Here we can see the chart of the total change for weight of the clients involved in the competition. Further down, we can see a graph of the same results, showing the rank, starting and ending values, total change, and percentage change. So you can quickly and easily assign winners and positions for the competition. Scrolling further down, you can see charts and graphs for each one of the different criteria that you're tracking. Also in the advanced features, we have the automated email system. Here, you can create a series of automated emails that the system will monitor and send out automatically on your behalf. And you can customize these emails for multiple different criteria. In this case, you can see we have a series of emails already created. Some are based on reminders. Some are based on specific goals being reached. The system will show you the created date and whether this email is actively being sent. 
You can add new emails by hitting the Add New me Email button, or edit any additional or any existing email using the Edit button. Here, we'll click Edit on one of the emails to see how this is accomplished. You can choose to email a group of either all users, all administrators, all limited administrators, or all trainers. Or you can have the email be sent to any individual in the system. You can put in a subject for the email and then a body of text, including if you want to insert first name, last name, or username of any client. And the system will automatically customize the email with this information. Further down the page, you can choose how you want the email sent. Do you want it sent on a schedule, specific days of the week, or a specific day of the month? After a specific goal is reached, using anything from the selected criteria, or if you want it sent as a reminder, a specific number of days before or after a specific event occurring. Once you have the email set up and saved, it will now be logged in the system and the system will track the criteria for every client and automatically send the applicable email to any client. Finally, in the advanced features, you have the ability to upload custom exercises. Here, you simply select the muscle group for the exercise you'd like to upload, and then you're going to input the name of the exercise, a description, various information about the joints and muscle groups, and then you can even upload up to three pictures, plus the muscle groups involved, and if you choose, you can upload a video link of your exercise as well. Any custom exercises added to the system are then available for all trainers to be used in programs being built for their clients. These are the advanced features in the admin menu. For additional information, see please see the admin basics training video, as well as the personal group fitness and billing system training videos. And also, remember to use the help icon in the upper right-hand corner of every page of the system for more specific information about that particular page.